Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and today I'm going to show you how to fix the Canon LBP2900B printer when it's not working on Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the printer troubleshooter. Now to do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon, afterwards make sure to click on system on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and just click on it. Now select other troubleshooters and lastly hit the run button next to printer. Now Windows will try to run some diagnostics on your PC and then you can check if the problem still persists. Afterwards you can just restart your computer and if it doesn't work you can move on to the next solution. Moving on, another useful fix is to restart the printer spooler service. To do this press the Windows button then type in services and select it as an application from the search results. And now in here as you can see the list is quite big so make sure to scroll down patiently until you find the printer spooler service and then double click on it to open up its properties window and in here make sure that the startup type is set to automatic. Now you can click on apply and ok to close this, then simply right click on the print spooler service and click on the restart option. This will restart the service and then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to update the drivers. To do this right click the windows button then select the device manager option. In here in the device manager window make sure to expand print queues, then right click on your problematic printer and select the update driver option. Now click on search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best available drivers on your PC. Otherwise you can just download the Canon printer drivers directly from their official website. And I will post a link in the description below, just follow that website, download your drivers and install them. Then you can check if the problem still persists. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course if this video helped you make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.